the crazy kaiju here, and we have the Toys Dream Project Meltdown Godzilla to show ya. <laughs> Let's begin with the box. The front looks great. As you can see, it's a 2005 10th Anniversary Limited Edition, promoting Final Wars on DVD. Nice window display for Mr. Goji. And as an awesome add-on, a Godzilla suit figure bobblehead bottle cap. Yeah! The back, just as sweet, with nice pics of what you get. The legal jargon on the lower part. Bottom only main titles. On side shows a window front view of the big G. Nice overall look. Other side shows what you get and what to do. Go! Top looks nice. Shows Godzilla has a tag. And again, the bubble head workings. <laughs> now it's time for the little guy. <laughs> nice setup. Ooh, a tail attachment. Well, technically he would be this guy. Under bottle cap, more accessories. I'll shut my hole so we can enjoy this montage. It's time to bubble. Mm. Now for the main meltdown monster guy. Yeah. This is a reissue from 1996, which was an 8 inch loose figure with a tag. Speaking of tags, here's his. This figure is a translucent soft vinyl. Mostly painted in the center area of Godzilla, leaving like his tail, feet, arms, and face in a translucent mood. He stands at 6 inches tall, and only has 5 points of articulation. And now for his close-up detail color montage. Ah. Time for size comparison. <laughs> Overall, a great addition to our collection. I'm keeping this guy in the box. It has a feel good nostalgic look. Plus, it shows off these two real good, don't you think? <laughs> Thanks for watching and have a good day. <laughs>